Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. I am Coach Sherry and welcome to my channel. This video, I want to talk about Dale Carnegie and something that I heard slash read in one of his books. Now, for those of you who may not be familiar with Dale Carnegie, he is a motivational, inspirational business guru, consulting coach, all of those things. But the interesting thing is he was born in 1888 and died in 1955. However, all of his content is evergreen because it has lasted through the course of time over the years. The information that he put out back in the day, back in the 1940s, 50s, is still very much relevant to this day. If you haven't picked up one of his books, I highly recommend it. You also can get them on audio and just to listen to the information that he shares, like how to win friends and influence people and just so many things that you'll just glean so many nuggets. But the other day I was listening to one of his books and he was sharing this story about a, the wind and the sun. And he was just using it as a metaphor saying how the wind and the sun were arguing about who could make someone come out of their coat first. And so the wind was big and bad and they was like, you know, oh, I will definitely make someone take off their coat. You know, I'm going to blow so hard. Their their coat's just going to fly off. So the sun said, all right, go ahead. You try first. The wind started blowing, blowing, blowing. The wind was blowing. The trees were swaying. Things were flying around. And sure enough, the people who had their coats on were, you know, trying to really hold on to their coats so they wouldn't fly off. And in the midst of doing that, they had to hold their head down they had to really push forward pushing through all of that wind so they would not lose their coats and lo and behold no one's coat came off it was just very very windy and then it was the sun's turn the sun came out it started shining so bright like a ray of happiness of of just joy on top of those people and the people looked up because they were so bent over from the wind and when they felt the sun on the back of their their neck they looked up and they just based in the sun and then next thing you know they started peeling off their coats and the sun won the sun was able to get the people to take their coats off and that's because they were that ray of light that ray of sunshine that happiness that happy place they made the people feel comfortable they made the people feel like you know what i want to feel this all over my body so who are you to the people that you encounter? Are you that strong wind, that one that's so determined to take people apart, to pick them a piece to pieces and to just have them scatter all over the place? Are you, or are you that sun that people are welcoming in, that you are making warm and giving them a real special glow? Which one are you? Leave me a comment and tell me, are you the strong wind or are you the bright sunshine? I choose to be the bright sunshine and I hope you do too. Thanks for tuning in and I'll be back soon.